Hello everybody, Brito Guy here, and welcome back to Core Keeper. Alright, last episode we did quite a bit of stuff, and in between episodes I did even more crap. Holy shit. Alright, so uh, I did a bunch of fishing. Like, I mean, a massive amount of fishing. Like, I would just leave my character and I'd go to work, and I worked 12 hour shifts. So that's 12 hours of my guy sitting there just fishing and pulling crap out. So we got like a massive amount of chests. I did like 60 some of these, 30 some of those, and like a few of these. And I don't think I opened all of them. There's still a few left here. But anyhow, like, we ended up getting uh, some good gear out of the process, too, because the Crimson uh, Chest had uh, the Corrupt Warden shorts and the tunic and the masks, so that's all good stuff for our summoner. Uh, what else do we get in there? I think that was it for that. Uh, for fishing-wise, we did end up getting the rest of the fishing, fishing outfit, and I went back to get another uh, golden fish ring, so now we have, like, a full set of gear of fishing, so we fish super fast, and we get a lot of fish, so that's pretty awesome. Uh, what else? And the pets. I knew the pets, they had skills. The last time, I didn't see these stupid little arrows on the side, and I've seen them now, duh, duh. All right, so now we got like different skill sets and stuff like that. So I just threw in what I had right now temporarily. So we do have some burn damage uh, against bosses, range attack speed, some critical hit damage. Then we got 30 points that uh, we can get for critical hit chance. There's physical range damage and um, burn damage applied. So it's another burn damage. Now I did go ahead and I did get a few more of these. Because I wanted to like check them out and see if like they would be better than the current one that I got. Um, so let's go and check some of these out. So we got burn rain to burn damage. We had glow, which doesn't really matter. Damage against bosses, attack range. Okay, pretty pretty mixed on that guy. Uh, let's try this one here. So attack range speed. Attack against bosses. Well, you got three of those. Physical range. Burn damage. Well, that's kind of a mix. We'll put that one to the side. Uh, put you up here. So these are pretty good. So instead of like doing like burn over time, it does all the damage in kind of like one shot. Um, critical hit chance. Range. Attack against bosses, critical hit, critical hit, and burn. So this one wouldn't be too, too bad. So you're kind of like a possible. Oh, wow. A lot of burn damage on this one. Against bosses. The glow. This one, too, would be actually really good, too, as well. So we'll put you here. Got a little tough choice. And this one, just garbage. Too much glow. Yeah. That one's just no good. We'll put you over here. All right, so we got a toss up between these three. So, in the comments below, we'll see if uh, what everybody wants. And you've seen the three, so comment to see which one would uh, you think would be best for me, and we'll go with one of these three. I'll have that uh, have that as a little poll, and uh, we'll also put the name up for for suggestions as well for anybody watching. Uh, you all will upvote a good name. I'll give the name to the pet. So we'll go with that. So comment below for that. And we'll continue. So um, what else have I done? I've done a massive ton of mining. Like a whole crap ton. Because eventually I want to like redo the whole interior of this. And make like a nice design and something party. So I'm kind of going for like the interior or something like this. And then we're going to have like, you know, different things out here. And then we'll have an outer layer, and that outer layer layer is gonna be like wood and farms and stuff like that. And then we're just gonna have a mob farm going all the way around. It's kind of like what I'm going for. And then we'll have like water in certain spots and all that kind of good stuff. So yeah, so like I'll slowly I'll work on this in between like episodes and all that kind of good stuff. Um, another thing, what happened is we ended up. Because I did so much AFKing, that uh, tin node at the bottom, those two tin nodes are absolutely empty now. So we have an absurd amount of tin. And from the chest and me and fishing, um, I was able to get like tons of ores. So that's 
pretty friggin awesome and because you get lots of items from fishing well you get lots of stuff to sell so we got lots of moolah let's just say right lots of bucks so what i want to start off with today is i want to start off by upgrading our our crap here a little bit so we got uh octane so that's like what level 11 let's see if we can go to like to 15 okay well no, we need Galaxic Bars. Never mind. All right, we'll just upgrade it to whatever we can upgrade for right now. So I guess we're going to need those, all those uh, Galactic Bars. All right, that's fine. That's fine. All right, so we got some a little bit better stuff anyways. Let's go with upgrading our crap rod, I guess, for now. There we go. There, maybe just it'll hit like a... Like a ton of bricks. Now I'm I'm hesitant to bring this one up because it does bring your mana cost up. So we go up to 32 mana cost. Which actually we kinda could afford maybe. What are we up to? 42 for each. 50 range. What level is this at? It's at seven. That should be level ten. Alright, let's stop at ten. <laughs> It'll take us a little bit to like, you know, do uh do minions, but um what do we got here? Fifty to six fifty-six. Okay, fifty to four to sixty-six. That's not bad. And then plus whatever damage we're giving them extra here as well. So that's pretty good. That shouldn't be too bad. Three. Okay, I can still summon four of them really quick. That's good. Alright, I'm okay with that. And then mana cost on that. All right, that's pretty good. I think we should be okay for, for now anyways. Now, what do we do? Well, I think what we should do is we should go investigate this area a bit. Um, there's also actually something else I want to buy first before we, uh, we kick her going here. There's like another kind of NPC that you can get in the game. And if we grab some of them and some of these... We can go over here, right? And we can go to this statue. And we can buy this ancient uh, hologram pod. We can buy one of these things. Okay. We're going to go bring it to our little NPC island here. Which is going to completely change. We can toss this thing down here. Well, we can purchase things from this guy here. And one of the things we need is this right here. So we need to bring... 10 of each ore. Except for gold. And three gemstones. And we can go get this. Expert that can be equipped and offhand. This will lure consistent of multiple edible and magical components. Attracting the one big catch. That reminds me of something too that we can we can actually have. Um, Alright, so let's go and grab ten of each. Um, there was something else that we picked up last episode. Speaking of food. Uh, where is that little guy? Do, 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 do. It's this thing right here. This is permanent. Permanent health. So we're just going to cook this up with anything and just eat it. And this should get us like permanent health. So we're at like 364. Was that with like me eating? Oh, it's because my guy is hungry. There we go. So we're at 530. So we take this little bad boy here. We eat that. There. Now we got a permanent health boost. That's that's great. That's great. I did I noticed that last episode, but I never really like paid attention to it. And I was looking at it and I was like, oh my god, that's like a, a health boost. So let's go put these little guys away for now. Put you guys away there. Um then oh yeah, the ores, right? You're kind of sidetracked there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then ten of them. Five of these. Ten of those. I don't think the octane ore was in there. So we should be good to purchase this thing now. Bam. Awesome. So now, if we do happen to find where the boss is for that area over here, we now have the thing that's going to that's gonna summon him. So we can use this to summon that guy. 
All right, so let me put all this stuff away, and we're gonna head over there, and we'll uh, we'll start adventuring over in that section. Okay, so there's also something that we discovered too when I was mining. You discovered these two little things here, and these are like musical doors. So if you kind of like, uh, I think it go up to them with your musical pad here, and then you could just see what the notes are, and you could keep like you know. Try your best to try to figure it out if you want. But if you go online, you can actually see what the notes are. So let's see here. There, that's the first line, second line. And so that should be like a Q. No, it didn't light up. Damn it. So go. it should go E, Y, U, T, E, Y, U. And then... <laughs> And then you get whatever's inside here. All right, so we got some enemies in here. And then you get like a chest. I want to pick this stuff up. All right, let's see what's in the chest. Ah, uh, just some normal garbage. Not too impressive. And that's just like stuff for sale. All right. So that's one. See, there's that in there. Then we have another one over here. That I found. So I'll figure this one out and we'll come back and... Alright, this one is going to be... E-R-T-E-W-Q-W. Alright, what have we got in here? They say sometimes you can get some good stuff in here, but we'll beg to differ. This is all like early game stuff. That's pretty good. Take the recall. It's not bad. All right, so I'll keep my flute on me in case we, uh, my Orcana, in case we do come across the other things. And then we'll go over to the uh, other place there. And we'll start investigating over there. Those guys are knocking out all me bloody torches. They're not cool. Making it dark in here. <laughs> Alright, so here we are in the horrible, horrible area. Ah. Only because of these things that snare you. They're such a pain in the ass. There we go. Get them, guys. Good thing we got loads of health. Alright, so let's get through here. Because they don't... Um, and you can't hit them with magic either. Which is another thing that really sucks. Uh, I guess maybe I could mine around them. And these things will spawn like right, right, right behind you too. That's a real pain in the ass. <clears throat> so we'll just keep uh, making some lines here and we'll go across them. We should eventually find them. Ooh, look at this. You got three nodes. That is sick. That is totally, totally awesome. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. I can dig this map. So we can uh, have like a teleporter or something here. I think we should be able to unlock that soon. I think maybe once we get that galactic ore crap. Oh, that's pretty cool. All right, so... <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty sick. Uh, like, I need those. Oh, look at this out in the middle of here. There's like a little island. Got a bunch of slime on it, but we can take care of that. Got uh, another red node here. That's pretty awesome. Looks like there's a tin one here as well. Pretty crazy. Oh, look at this. We got another tin. <laughs> <laughs> That's freaking hilarious. Finding all these tin nodes. That's cool, man. You won't, won't, won't run out of uh, stuff, anyways. We found some kind of alien structure. That's kind of neat. Let's see if we can go find a way into this place. Look at this area. Oh, it looks like a, a fungal area. Oh, that's neat. I like that. I like those trees. They're pretty sick. 
Oh, we got a teleporter here, ladies and gentlemen. We got a teleporter. Hope we got a teleporter here. It means there must be a boss nearby. And I hear something. Oh yeah, I think he's like right there. So, from my experience, um, when it comes to these big guys, if you don't get too close and you kind of stay like off screen, like if I shoot him from here, oh, get a little bit closer. Yeah, I don't know if this is gonna work. I don't have a, a ranged weapon. This isn't this doesn't shoot far enough, which really sucks. Okay, so we've initiated combat. We'll get him to mine out an area here. There you go. Maybe we can get him to do this there. Oh yeah, that's a pretty good tactic. I like that tactic. Because I guess he's only going to go so far away from his arena. I like that. What the hell? Are you going to start dropping crap? Oh, I didn't mean to eat. Yeah. That's pretty cool. It's a good, uh, good thing to know. Alpha me. Uh, get away from the, the goop. Oh, he is coming over here. I think it's more guys out there. He should be almost dead. There we go. Awesome. I got a purple one too. Uh, Ivy's ring. Oh, it's a thorns thing. That's cool. You have to try to pick all this crap up. Alright, let's get rid of... You. You. I can always come back here and pick up this stuff. Lots of seeds. Let's see, are those. I'll well, keep the carrot ones. That's pretty good. Nice. So, it looks like we got ourselves at least uh, one boss done so far. That's pretty cool. Pick up all this purple slime. Alright, so we need to kill a bunch of these blue guys. Uh, these guys over here. Those guys here are going to have drop feathers, I believe. And I think it's the feathers that we're going to be looking for right now. Because we can actually look for that in particular boss with a scanner. And I think that's what we're going to do. So we'll just try to fight a bunch of these guys and hopefully they drop us a feather eventually. I'm not sure if it's uh, the normal ones or if it's these guys. It might be the other guys, but... We'll just kill them all. Oh, look at that. A ring and a necklace. Ooh, pay attention there, bug. So you can find them on the ground, too. Oh, look at that. There's another... Uh, another node over here. That's sweet. <clears throat> look at this. We got ourselves an iron node over here. That's pretty crazy. Totally awesome. Oh yeah, you just decided to spawn there like that, did ya? Hey, little shit. So we're just looking for one more, um, one more feather. Oh. And we'll be able to, uh... I wonder if these guys are the ones spawning them. That's crazy. 
Nice, we got the feather. I can go back. Alright, so with the 10 feathers that we gathered, we were able to buy this here. And this will show us where the uh, next boss is. So that's pretty awesome. So let's use that. Dope. Let's check it out. So, yeah, we were pretty far off looking up here and stuff. But I think I might have maybe gotten it eventually, but probably would have been there for quite a while. So let's head in down that way and we'll see about uh, fighting the boss. Oh, so this is the area by the looks of it. Look at all the feathers on the ground. That's kind of cool. I guess uh, good for resummoning them, I guess. Maybe. Or maybe refining them. Who knows? Alright, let's get rid of some of this crap that I have on me. And then we'll fight them. Alright, so apparently if we just put this down right here, this uh, egg, this should attract them. And we should be able to initiate combat with them. Now, I think we just gotta make sure we stay alive. And we just make sure that uh, our guys are just shooting them. I think that would be a good thing to do. Just pay attention to his patterns and heal whenever I can. But this doesn't seem too bad so far. You guys are doing good. So we just pay attention to the patterns, Bog. Pay attention to the patterns. That's pretty good. Oh, snap. Oh, yeah. What's up with them crystals? Can we break them things? Oh, higher mining damage. This. Oh, there, there you go. Is that a thing? Is this what we have to do? Is like maybe destroy these crystals? Ah, just guessing. You really uh, watch out for my bloody health here. Eh? All right, summon some more new minions. Cause I'm pretty sure these guys are getting old. All right. Shoot them, boys. I don't think the crystals really matter. As long as uh, we just don't die. I think that's what matters. <laughs> oh, shit. Alright, that was good. That wasn't bad. That wasn't bad. I'm going to start a little bit more crazy on those things, huh? Try to shoot you a little bit, too, as well. Yeah, so I think these crystals heal them. Is that a thing? Looks like it. Oh, oh. Alright, let's get up here. We have a few more guys here. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. You gotta get rid of these stupid crystals. Yeah, because he's healing hardcore off of that, eh? Okay, let's build a bridge over here. Just so we can mine these crystals. <clears throat> Is there any more around here? In the middle here. This is crazy. Alright, pretty good. No healing, bastard. Oh, shit. Oh, that's not good. You guys need to be attacking more, eh, by the way. Not attacking more. Enough. These damn crystals. Then we're gonna walk over to heal, 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 heal. <laughs> I don't think these potions are really any good. You're gonna need uh, better potions. To this, we're good. Do not bad, do not bad. Okay, so we gotta get over here, kill these things. Nice, nice, we did it. Huh, first try, too. Pretty awesome. That's, uh, well, that's our first, um, the hell are those things? First soul. Nice. Is it not going to let me place anything here? 
Now, do we have to grab that with our hand or something? How does this work? Uh, interesting. I'm sure we're going to need that thing. Is it because it died there and it kind of glitched out in the air? Is this kind of like what we're dealing with here? Interesting. I don't know. Is this supposed to be mine? I don't know. What is this thing? Is that its soul? Because <laughs> I don't want to come back here and like have to pick this thing up if it unglitches. Yeah, I just can't build here whatsoever. Wonder if that's a thing all over the place. No, it's just exactly right where that thing died. Huh, wonder if that's like a bug. Or can I get this thing? I don't know how to get that. That's weird. It's very weird. What else we get? Just remains. The amount of food for fish. Place in a habitable room and a character of interest. Oh, a fishing boat. Okay, so that's how we get another character. That's pretty cool. That's good. All right, so let's make it back to base and um, life on melee, mining damage. That's pretty good. Is that better than the other one? It is better than the other one. All right, and this one is physical melee. And we got more broken swords. All right, let's get back to base and I'll check this out. I don't know what the hell this is. I don't know how to get this. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this. I th think you got to get one of those crystals maybe that you buy from the guy. Uh, I'd really hate to... I wonder if there's a teleporter nearby. Usually there's a teleporter near these bases. Let me just have a little look. Aha! I knew there would be a teleporter nearby. I had a good feeling of that. That's good. Let's um let's go back here. <clears throat> I think one of these crystals you gotta put the the souls in. You buy it from maybe one of these guys. We get some money. Maybe this guy here. Humper no. Nope. These are just all for summoning bosses. Hmm. I'm not really 100% sure what that, uh, about that thing floating in the air then is. I thought I was supposed to be able to grab that thing. So, I guess on that note, I'm going to leave it there. And we did pretty good today. We killed two bosses. <laughs> Got some stuff and then God knows what the hell this thing is. It looks like it's an item I could be able to grab. But anyways, I'll, I'll figure out, oh, it's gone. It disappeared. No. <laughs> I truly hope that wasn't important because we're going to have to resummon the boss again if that's the case. It just sucks that he died over a hole. Uh, oh well. Anyways. <laughs> hope you enjoyed the video, everybody. Like, subscribe, peace, take care, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.